my channel if you're new here my name is Marilyn and if you're not new welcome back so today I am kind of pre-filming this is like the third video so if you guys see me wearing the same thing for three different videos that is why so anyways today I'm going to be doing my Lord of the Rings project pan update and my friend Nat little miss Nat is the creator of this project pan so this is a collab video with her I will have all of her information in the description box so you guys could go check her out and watch her Lord of the Rings update as well so in this project pan we do have a full-size product that represents the wizard which is Gandalf and then we do have four sample size products that represent the hobbits I have them right here so I'm going to begin with a full-size product and this one is the 657 Nude Nuance Maybelline lipstick so as you can see it is a full size Okay, so this lipstick, I only used this six times this past month, which I feel like it's not too bad, but I mean, I could have done better. And this is what the lipstick looks like. It's almost done, so that makes me really happy. I'm going to put a picture of what I looked like last month. Hopefully, I have it. We are going to compare right now and see if there's any difference. So that's where it's at right now. Hopefully, you guys could see it. It's just a little bit above three inches. I haven't seen the picture of last month or I don't even remember if I have a picture of last month, but I will insert whichever picture I have so you guys could see the difference. Anyways, I feel like I could actually finish this up like in two months if I use it almost every single day, which I should just do that. I don't know why I don't do that. But anyways, that's the first product, but I'm still happy that I was able to use it six times. Okay, so now the next product, it is a Tartiest Lip Paint. Now this one, I have used it a little bit more and I have used it seven times and it's this one right here. And I feel like it's almost done. I mean, you can't really see that, but when I apply it, it's like kind of dry. See, there's like hardly any product on the applicator. So maybe I am almost done with it. So as you can see, there's like hardly any product in there. But I will continue to use it one more month and, and I will remove the stopper to see if I could get more product out of here. Now the next product, it is a Sunshine Gloss, the one that looks like a little light bulb. And it's this one right here, it's very cute. And this one, I also have been using it a lot more often than the other lip products. I have used this one 13 times and you could kind of see that it's almost completely done. So I can't wait for that to happen because it is kind of annoying to get the lip gloss from the sides right here so I do have to like leave it all on one side and then scrape it and then I don't know it's just kind of hard and it doesn't have a stopper but anyways I really like this lip gloss I like the glitters some glitters are kind of chunky but I don't really mind them hopefully I could finish this lip gloss by next month okay now the next product it is a blush and this one is a Too Faced Apricot in the Act blush very cute and small and let's see this blush I have used it a quite a few times I have used it 17 times so I feel like that's a lot but you can't really see that much progress I mean you can see some movement but it's not like super noticeable I do mix both of these together so it could be like a shimmery blush because you guys already know I love shimmery blushes I'm hoping to make a little dip by the end of June so hopefully I could show you guys a better progress next month. Okay, and the last product was a little perfume. And this one was the Violet Perfume. It doesn't have a name on the little tube, but it is completely gone. And this smelled really good. It smelled like lavender. I just really liked how it smelled. And since I finished that product, I am going to be rolling in another sample size perfume. And it's just this little sample right here. Very cute. Oh, and it's not completely full. It's like up here. So I will be marking it right there. But I'm pretty sure I'll finish this in a month. So anyways, that's all of the products that I have in my Lord of the Rings project pan. I'm happy how this project pan is going. I feel like I've made a lot of progress. So anyways, make sure to go check out my friend Nat, Little Miss Nat. Her YouTube channel will be in the description box. So anyways, that is all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye, guys.